ocean is full of animals. In fact, it's believed that there are more animal species in the ocean compared to that on land. While most of these animals are benign, some of them can be outright deadly. No sharks on this list, maybe too obvious. But check out the creature at number one, the unlikeliest deadly animal on the list. Here are 10 of the world's deadliest ocean creatures. Number 10, the lionfish. Lionfishes might look beautiful, but don't let its looks fool you. The very things that make this fish one of the most majestic fish in the ocean are also the same things that make them very dangerous. The lionfish is named because of the massive array of spines that it has all over its body, which resembles a lion's mane. These spines won't kill you, but they do contain venom so painful it's said to make you wish that you were dead. These fish are very wary of humans, so there is little to no danger of a lionfish actively pursuing and poking a diver with one of its spines. These prickly appendages are mainly used for defense against predators. But if you find yourself diving in the Caribbean or Eastern Atlantic, which is where lionfishes are found, I still advise you to treat the lionfish with the utmost caution, and just admire these beautiful white-striped creatures from a distance. Number 9. The Cone Snail when thinking about the most dangerous sea creatures, snails are unlikely candidates. And that's why number 9 on our list might come to you as a surprise. It is the lowly cone snail. Cone snails are only 10 to 15 centimeters long and look quite innocent, but a single drop of their venom is said to be enough to kill 20 men. If you are an enthusiastic shell collector, we recommend you handle these fellows with care. Cone snails, for reasons that are quite obvious, aren't active and aggressive hunters of prey, but rather harpoon their prey with their hollow teeth and inject a lethal venom through it. Cone snails can be found in the deep reef waters all the way from the Indian and Pacific Oceans to the Caribbean and Red Seas, and also along the coasts of Florida. But the ones residing in the Indo-Pacific region tend to have more harmful toxin than others. Do not try your luck anywhere with these creatures, though. They aren't called cigarette snails for nothing. Why is that, you might ask? Well, their venom is so toxic that once stung, a person only has time to smoke a single cigarette before he or she eventually dies. Number 8. The Stingray Although the chances of you being stung by a stingray is next to nothing, they still deserve to be called one of the deadliest animals in the ocean. A stingray's tail is long, thin and tapered, much like a whip. At the end of the tail are one or more barbed spines covered by a sheath. Each spine contains venom and the stingray's tail can peck a powerful, incredibly painful sting. When stung by a stingray, you'll feel immediate severe pain at the wound site. If the barb has punctured your throat, neck, abdomen, or chest, or has pierced completely through part of your body, seek emergency medical attention immediately. Otherwise, what happened to Steve Irwin might happen to you. Ugh, rest in peace, sir. Stingrays don't actually hunt for divers and swimmers. They'll be stung by a stingray only if you step on it, and it will then defend itself by using its sting, which is quite likely since the stingrays prefer to lie half buried at the bottom of the ocean. So when diving in stingray country, watch your step. The venom of these creatures is extremely painful, and some stingray species can be fatal to humans in particular. Number 7. The Stonefish. The next predator on our list has a camouflage so effective you wouldn't be able to see it even if it was two inches away from your nose. Actually, more accurately, that would be your toes, a fact that only adds to its deadliness because it already has one of the most toxic naturally occurring poisons in nature. The stonefish is the proud owner of the title of the most venomous fish in the world. These creatures might not be the biggest fish in the ocean, only growing a few inches long, but they are living proof of the fact that you don't have to be huge in order to be a threat. The venom of a stonefish can cause excruciating pain and temporary paralysis, already a lethal combination especially if you're diving miles away from the nearest help. It can also cause instantaneous heart failure if you're unlucky. Fortunately though, there is an anti-venom developed for stonefish's toxin, but it won't do you any good, especially if you're out diving alone with no one to help you. The reassuring fact for divers is that stonefishers won't actually attack you. These creatures use their venom only as a defense mechanism when divers accidentally step on them. However, that doesn't mean that people haven't succumbed to the stonefish's deadly cocktail. Number 6. The Great Barracuda The Great Barracuda is among the top predators in their environment and use very highly developed smell and vision senses to locate their prey. When attacking, the barracuda will charge at fast speeds and ram their target. They then unleash the power of their jaws, which allows them to slice through their prey, even those larger than the barracuda itself. 
Their jaws are constructed in such a way that it mimics a pair of scissors, paired with extremely sharp teeth, and slices through flesh and bone with ease. Attacks on humans by great barracudas are rare. Inquisitive, sight-oriented fish, barracudas sometimes exhibit the unnerving habit of trailing snorkelers and divers. When an attack does occur, more often than not, it's because a barracuda attempts to steal a fish from spearfishers or mistakenly interprets a shiny object, such as a diving knife, for the glint of a shiny fish. But then again, it's hard not to imagine one of these attacks ending with a couple of severed fingers. Number 5. The Saltwater Croc No listing of predators is complete without some huge reptiles, am I right? The fifth place on our list goes quite unsurprisingly to the saltwater crocodile. These bad boys kill on average two people per year. These salties are branded as the most dangerous animal of Australia. That's really something to consider when we're talking about a continent infamous for its vast array of deadly fauna. Weighing up to 1,200 kilograms, saltwater crocs are the largest crocodilians on the planet. And with their size comes a lethal power. Saltwater crocodile has the most powerful bite in the world, and its jaw has 10 times more strength than the great white sharks. Unlike other predators on our list, which I guess makes these creatures terrifyingly special, saltwater crocs are murderous on both the land and sea. They might not be as fast on dry land as some horror stories tell, but they can swoop attack quicker than us poor humans can react. Number 4. The Sea Snake Sea snakes include about 30 to 50 different species, which are most likely to be met in the tropical waters of the Pacific and Indian Oceans. These creatures are part of the cobra family, and are 2 meters long on average. Sea snakes aren't very aggressive animals. They'd actually rather keep to themselves, but due to their highly toxic venom, they slither their way on our list. It only takes a fraction of a drop of their venom to kill a fully grown man. Symptoms of sea snake poisoning occur within 30 minutes to several hours. They include headache, stiffness, and muscle pain throughout the body. Thirst, sweating, vomiting, and a thick-feeling tongue may also happen. Even though sea snakes are likely to hide from us humans, it's always safer if you don't get too close to these animals. Because in the unlikely event that a sea snake would want to bite you, it can do so easily even through your wetsuit. If you happen to get bit by a sea snake, your chances of survival are next to none. Number 3. The Blue Ringed Octopus At first glance, the Blue Ringed Octopus looks perfectly innocuous. Its psychedelic coloring and pint-sized packaging makes it seem more adorable than alarming. But don't let its cuddly exterior fool you. This tiny octopus can kill you, and it does so very quickly. Heck, there's a reason it's on several of our lists. Native to the Pacific Ocean, the Blue Ringed Octopus can be found in the soft, sandy bottom of shallow tight pools and coral reefs. When not seeking food or a mate, Blue Ringed Octopuses often hide in crevices, shells, or marine debris. If you catch them outside of their cozy hiding spots, it's easy to see how the animal gets its name. When threatened, bright blue rings appear all over its body as a warning signal to potential predators. Although all octopuses are venomous, the blue ringed octopus is in a league of its own. Its venom is a thousand times more powerful than cyanide, and this golf ball sized powerhouse packs enough venom to kill 26 humans within minutes. It's really no surprise that it's recognized as one of the most dangerous animals in the ocean. Now it's time for today's best pick. Today's best pick is a creature that definitely looks dangerous, but does its look equal to its bite? Find out more next with number two, the giant monkfish. The monkfish is a strange and somewhat terrifying looking fish, but it is in fact perfectly suited for its life as a deep water predator. Monkfish have a number of adaptations which make them adept at catching their prey. The protuberance, which comes from their head, known as the esca, can be moved in any direction and is used to attract small fish which think it is something to eat. Once they are in range, the monkfish snaps forward with incredible speed to devour the fish in its massive mouth. The teeth of the monkfish are hinged, which allows the prey fish to be held securely in the monkfish's jaws. The monkfish also has an expendable stomach, which means they can eat fish which are almost as large as itself. It might even try to take a bite off a diver's hand, which, although unlikely, has actually happened. In one rare incident, a diver mistook a monkfish for a grouper. He then proceeded to touch the presumably harmless fish, only for the monkfish to clamp down on his hand with its vice-like grip. The diver's friends actually had to pry the monkfish's mouth open with anything and everything they think they could use. Fortunately, the diver had thick diving gloves on. If not, things would have ended pretty badly. 
Before we move on, do me a favor. My analytics show that only about 15% of you watching are actually subscribed. Come on guys, what's up with that? Can you guys please hit the subscribe button? You guys watch my videos every day anyway, so you might as well subscribe and keep up to date with every video we put out. Number 1. The Box Jellyfish the most dangerous sea creature on our list might not have rows of razor-sharp teeth. It doesn't have any visible mouth at all. But it has caused more human deaths in Australia than snakes, sharks, and saltwater crocodiles combined. These creatures are transparent and pale blue in color, which makes them almost invisible in the water. It actually took quite a long time before anyone even realized what was causing unsuspecting swimmers and divers such agonizing pain. One box jellyfish contains enough venom to kill up to 60 people. And what makes them even more dangerous is the speed at which their venom acts inside a human body. The sting of a box jellyfish can kill you in less than five minutes. Unlike other jellyfishes floating with the currents, these fellows can swim, making a run-in with divers more likely. Other traits that set them apart from other jellyfish is their ability to see. They have clusters of eyes on each side of their box-shaped body, and these abilities support the belief that instead of waiting for food to bump into their tentacles, a box jellyfish might hunt for prey. Fortunately for divers, though, their menu mainly consists of shrimp and not humans. Know of any other deadly creatures? Let us know down below in the comments. Also, please check out the channel's other amazing videos. As always, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Later, everybody.